Hey dear friends, welcome back to 23. In this episode, we will learn access specifier in Java. So let's get started. First of all, I want to tell you we have four axis specifier okay we have four axis specifier public protected private no problem public private protected and the default okay public public means you have access the public modifier you have access public modifier everywhere you have access everywhere okay on the private you have access just inside the class and protected you have access in the subclass of different package okay and the default you have access inside same package protected in the subclass of different package same package same package okay no it is different package let's check no problem we will check it first of all inside the class I want to make this static or don't set it public void display display limit now I want to make a Java app class and add the display now inside the class 
it is no matter it is public it is private it is protected it is default no problem as you can see we have access display method if you change this to private again we will have access okay we have access if we make this protected again we will have access no problem inside the class if we have this default default we don't we will not write default keyword we doesn't have default keyword okay default is just in interface when you don't put public protected public protected or private it means default now this is default you have access them inside a class no problem but outside of the class outside of the class for example if i have a class a okay if i have a class a and inside the class a i have a display method with private that time we will not have access okay now if I change this to a that time we will not have access to this parameter as you can see we doesn't have access private just you have access public everywhere private just you have access inside the class not outside the class even you extend the class a also you will not have access to the private method as you can see you, you are not access you doesn't have access all public void this for example you are not allowing to call display method as you can see you are not allowing it doesn't have x because this is private but if you change this to public you will have access now okay display as you can see now you have access also without standing you can access by object okay because it is public also inside the same package inside the same file if it is default this means default it is not a problem as you can see you can have access also extends uh, you can have access In protected also is the same okay protected also works same as you can see with inheritance and with object you have access but now I want to put this
I want to make another class uh, now as you can see we have access in the same package also As you can see, protected in the same package works as like as like as default. Okay, in the same package works protected and default as same. In same package protected is equal to default. Okay. So now if I have different package for example I want to make a package app and I want to to move the A class inside the app package now as you can see we doesn't have access also now you should import it import app dot a why now it doesn't have access even we cannot import it because the a is default we can make it public okay now it is not a problem now in different uh, we said you have access in the subclass of different package in the same package it works as like as default but in different package it is accessible just in the subclass okay as you can see now a is in different package java app is in another package you can access to display because you extend it but you cannot make an object okay if I remove this then you will not have access okay so you have access in the subclass of different package in the same package it works as like as default So this was the access specifier lesson. I hope you enjoy it and don't forget to subscribe my channel and right now goodbye.